Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jamie, and if you're new here, I do weird shit on my channel. Yeah, and then Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I put out content, so if you're new, hit that subscribe button, and the like button, all that cool YouTube jazz. Right now, as you can see, I am in my kitchen. So today I started looking through my cookbook. I got this for Christmas from my mother-in-law and she's so sweet. She wrote like a little note on the back. It's a little note, it's so cute. Anyways, I wanted a dessert. I wanted to make something. I was like, I don't have a lot of stuff. I had like a half a bag of frozen blueberries. I was like, all right, let's see if I can find a dessert I can make with blueberries, right? So I was looking through the cookbook and I found a dessert called blueberry buckle. And I was like, all right, let's try, let's make it. I had everything I needed. It was really simple, like flour, sugar, butter, Crisco, stuff like that, right? So I thought blueberry buckle was like a blueberry crisp. You guys will see in the video. I realized I filmed the whole thing, baking it and everything without audio. So for most of this video, it is gonna be a voiceover. Yeah, I did accidentally film baking the whole thing without audio again, you guys, because I'm fucking idiot so this is my second time filming an intro but hi you guys didn't probably even need to know that or want to know that but that is it this is my life right now i was in a really bad slump the last few days and i just have not been doing that great so this kind of motivated me i started making it and i was like you know what i'm just gonna film it i'm gonna film it i'm gonna show you guys like i've been stuck in my house for so long starting to lose my mind so yeah i tried baking which i am not good at baking I'm not, I'm not good at baking at all. I suck, I'm so bad at it, I'm so bad at it. So, if you guys are interested in seeing how I make this blueberry buckle thing, it's supposed to look like this. We will see if it ends up looking like this. Long story short, I didn't look to see what a picture of a blueberry buckle was until I put it in the oven. Then I like posted on Facebook, I was like, oh yeah, I'm making a blueberry buckle. And everyone's like, what the fuck is that? I'm like, actually, really, I don't know. So then I Googled it, <laughs> found out it's not it at all what I thought I was baking. It's not a crisp, you guys, you'll see. Anyways, enjoy the video, enjoy the voiceover. I'll see you at the end with the results and we'll, t we'll do a little outro together, okay? I love you guys, enjoy the video. All right, here we go, you guys. Me being all fancy and stuff with my bowls. So yeah, we just uh, beat up this Crisco shortening, whatever you want to call it, and then I'm adding the sugar and the egg. I forgot to show a clip of the egg, my bad. After you do the sugar, you add the egg in there and you whip it around. Uh, I don't have a fancy mixer like a lot of people do. I just work with what I got, and by no means am I a baker. And now you gotta add the dry stuff to the wet stuff, like it says, and then slowly add in some milk while you're going, and this is gonna make, like, a dough. You guys, at this point, I legit still thought I was making a crisp. Like, I threw up some pictures, you guys know, I really thought I was making a crisp. Don't mind my arguing children in the background, they are constantly arguing. <laughs> But yeah, I really truly believed at this point I was still making a crisp, especially right here when I lay down the batter into the pan. It's so thin and I was like, oh, this is going to be so good. I was thinking it was going to be like this crisp. Oh man, I really truly thought that and I was just spreading it out. I, You know when you like read something and you, there's not a picture and you imagine something in your head? Yeah, I was sold that I was making a crisp. These blueberries were frozen. I let them thaw out in the sink um, in some cold water, like I did a cold water bath. Um, I don't know if that was how I was supposed to do it. I, like I said, I am not a baker, so I don't know. Um, and then this was the crumble. You guys, I've never made a crumble before, so I really didn't know what I was doing. I, my husband was like sitting on the couch out in the living room, and I was like, hey, what do I use? What do I do? How do I do this? I definitely didn't show you guys all the clips of me like shoving my hands in there having to like spread out this butter it was a nightmare but I did get it and then we're sprinkling this over the blueberries which in a lot of the pictures it said or like it said to put the blueberries on top so that's what I did but then if when you're looking at all these pictures online of a blueberry buckle they all look mixed into the batter so I don't know what I did wrong. I set a timer here for 50 minutes on my Amazon Echo because I'm fancy. This is uh, 20 minutes left. I wanted to look at it and it did not look that good, you guys. And so this is when I found out what I was actually making. So I'm showing you guys like, you guys, it says just to lay the blueberries on top. It doesn't say to mix them in, but all the pictures look like you should have mixed the blueberries into the batter. 
And then my husband comes in, and I'm starting to, like, get really worried. The timer went off. It still didn't look very good. And this is the crisp that I thought I was making. And that's the buckle that I, it's supposed to look like. See how the blueberries are mixed in? So I'm starting to panic at this point. I'm trying to explain to you guys, like, I don't know what I'm doing. I, it said to put the blueberries on top. This doesn't look right. And the blueberries were, like, really soggy and, like, watery. And I don't know if that's because they were frozen I did make sure to remove all the ice chunks, but I told my husband, I'm like, if you don't like it, just be honest with me, and then I let it go, actually, for like 62 minutes, I let it go for 12 more minutes till it got really crispy, and then this is me, obviously, taking it out of the oven here, you guys, here we go, and I'm trying to show you guys, and yeah, there it is, my fancy blueberry buckle, and I think it turned out pretty darn good. I'm I'm thoroughly impressed with myself. And this is me just being a dork, thinking I have audio when I don't have audio. I'm like, you guys, it actually looks pretty good. It smelled a little weird. I wasn't like a big fan of the smell, but it, I was kind of goofing off trying to get a thumbnail right here, you guys. Don't judge me, okay? And then this is me cutting it, slicing it, obviously. And it it uh it definitely has like the thickness of a pound cake which i talk about here in a minute with you guys but it's just uh if you like blueberries this was super easy if i can do this you guys can do this i promise you so i hope you guys enjoyed this little voiceover of me while we watch me bake okay you guys so this is my second time showing you guys this because the first time i didn't have audio i'll leave it up here of me showing you guys it the first time when it first came out of the oven so but i didn't have audio so this is the cake right here it turned out really, really good. We ate some already. And yeah, it's actually not a crisp. <laughs> it is like a, it, it's very similar to the consistency of a pound cake. Really dense, but then it has like that nice layer of crispiness on top and it's really good. I'm really proud of myself. I, I wish I had audio. I'm such a dumbass, but you know, I'm sure I showed you guys some stuff. I'm sure and I'm sure you're watching it right now. I was really shocked. I was really surprised that it turned out good. I could not believe that it worked and that like I was like, oh my god, I actually made this. It's really, really good. And it's a really easy recipe. So if you have a half a bag of frozen vegetables or frozen blueberries and then you have flour, sugar, and all of, like the easy like baking stuff that you're supposed to have, you can make this and it's really easy. So if I can do it, I know you can do it. But if you guys enjoyed that video, if you guys liked watching me panic bake and not miserably fail but i thought i was going to then hit that like button down below comment let me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i love you guys so 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 much please subscribe because monday's makeup monday video fire you guys filming it right now and it's gonna be good okay it's gonna be good you ain't gonna want to miss it so i love you guys i'm gonna go I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go eat some of my blueberry buckle. Ooh, blueberry buckle. Ooh. Okay, I love you guys. I'll see you.